Welcome everybody, I'm Junior Lucano and today I want to talk about the SRH isodampter and how to mount it in the SRH stabilized remote head, SRH3 and SRH360. In order to take full advantage of the performance of the SRH remote head, it's advisable to use the isodampter. The isodampter absorbs all types of high frequency vibration and compensates the undesired movement and load chains on cranes and dollies. The reason why we make our own isodampter is quite simple. The available isodampter for large remote heads are simple too strong and therefore too stiff, while the available isodampter for gimbal are simple too weak and therefore too soft. The SRH isodampter is especially made for the SRH3 and SRH360 and perfectly adjusts to the possible camera setup and payloads. How does it work? The SRH vibration isolator may hemisphere made with kind of silicon placed here like a sandwich. The silicone responds with a very soft and slightly delayed movement to the incoming shock and movement. The design allows vertical movement, angular movement, in roll and tilt, but keep the pan very solid. Therefore, the maximum power can be used in the pan axis when you need it. The strength of the damping and the maximum linear movement can be regular by three screws. First, let's mount the Mitchell mount to the base of the SRH3, or if the Mitchell mount is already mounted, let's make sure that all the screws are fully tightened. Please note that loose screws on the mounting base cause unwanted vibrations. Take off the castle nut of the SRH isodampter and place the isodampter into the Mitchell mount of the crane. Use the silver cast nut of the SRH to mount the SRH isodampter into the crane. Use the tool of the SRH Mitchell mount to tie the castle nut fully. Lift the SRH carefully into the isodampter. Avoid to scratch thread. Now use the brass castle nut of the isodampter to secure the SRH inside the isodampter. To tighten the brass castle nut, you will need a special tool. With the three adjusting screw, the strength of the silicon balls can be required performance. The highly payload or dynamic of the movement will be, the tighter screw have to be. Low silicon balls can generate low frequency vibration. 